So compare the growth of the U.S. when we had a gold standard with the average growth we've had since we went off it in the early 70s. From the 1790s to the 1970s, despite civil war, despite two world wars, despite the Great Depression, the average growth rate was far higher than we've had since the early 1970s, on average. If we'd maintained gold standard growth rates since the 1970s, the U.S. economy today would be 50 percent larger than it is now. Gold, in this sense, is a measure of value, keeping the dollar stable and value better than anything else. It doesn't restrict the money supply. If you have a vibrant economy, you get a huge surge in money supply. We did that in the U.S. in the 1800s. Gold supply in the world went up threefold. U.S. money supply, even though the dollar is fixed to gold, went up 160-fold. A lot of myths about gold, but gold combines flexibility in terms of a growing economy, but also stability in terms of value. <laughs> 